guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to film a little eat with us mukbang. Um, I don't really like to call it mukbang because people call us out that we don't order enough food. We just, I know, we're, we're just not, eating. Yeah, we're just eating, so. You know, we got some good in and out because I'm hungry and I really wanted a burger. Yes, I'm so yeah. hungry. And we're just gonna talk to you guys, you know, update you, even though there's not really much, but yeah. There's a little bit. Let's get into it. I'm leaking sauce. And that's how you know it's good, guys. If it's leaking, it's delicious. No lettuce is so bad. <laughs> really? I was really craving in and out burgers. If you guys don't like in and out burgers, I'm convinced you're a psychopath. Sorry. They're pretty good and cheap. Mm hmm. If you need a cheap meal, that was a good bite. <laughs> we didn't have drinks out here, dude. I'm gonna get us some water. I got one. If you get a burger and fries, from like what, Carl's Jr., Burger King, you're paying $10 just for yourself to eat. In and out, two animal fries, two burgers, $15 for two people to eat. Yeah, that's crazy. Like, that's insane to me, you know. And Jack in the Box is stupid cheap. Oh, yeah. Depending like, on what you get, though. You get 15 okay. mini tacos for like three bucks. Like, what? Why do I need this many chilies? I really don't. Um, whatever. If you don't like spicy stuff, don't talk to me. She's a psycho for spicy stuff. I'm a Mexican. Gets a little spicy. I like spicy, but not that spicy. Okay, you're actually pretty good with like spice for, you know, a white person. For a white guy? Mm-hmm. I like how we just started this without even been like, we've been, how long have we been gone? Three weeks. Honestly, guys, mm, no, probably like two, two and a half, maybe. Okay, I promise we didn't do it on purpose or okay. slack in. Your girl has been working a lot at work. COVID is spreading like crazy, so I had to work a lot of overtime. But we just don't want to film. Like, we should technically film on the weekdays. Yeah. This burger's kind of pink. I'm unattracted. And we need ideas, guys. Like, what are you interested in watching? What do you like? What see? do you guys? When you click on someone's channel. What's the video you want to see? For our channel. Yeah, and our like channel what? specifically. Well, just in general too. Maybe we can switch it up, you know? We're different from everybody. We don't want to post everybody's content. True. But like, what's the video you would want to see that you would actually sit through and not like want to skip through? I kind of want to make like long, like 30 minute videos, 20 minute videos. Doing what? I don't know. We have the podcast, but I think our channel, it'd be cool to do like five to 15 minute videos in that time frame. Come on, we gotta switch it up. We gotta be crazy. But I think the hardest part is finding time to film. Cause we don't wanna film when she gets home from work. It's already dark out, we can't go out and vlog. We can't do anything. We just gotta bet like a million. What? We just gotta bet a million on a casino machine. That's a great thumbnail. Bet a million? Or jumble a million. And that was a good video. <laughs> I'm just kidding. The video of us crying, we lost our house. They'd probably get views. Literally. I don't know why we haven't posted. We're just boring Vegas people, guys. Hey, we're kind of boring. We don't do much, but if you guys want to see just regular day to day, I can show what I do. Well, Brittany's at work. I've done that before, but it's kind of boring. I just want it to be summer again. I think mm -hmm. summer is going to like be really good for us. I agree. Because it gets dark at like 5 o'clock, dude. I know. It's just like that boring time of the year. I don't want to do anything. Dark early. Yeah. And it's cold to me, so I don't even want to go outside. Like, what time is it? Eight right now? Is it? Oh, yeah. yeah. It was dark at like seven. That's not that bad. It was dark at like five. I don't think so. Because when we went outside, my friend's truck, I could see. Kinda. I think 6.30ish mm -hmm. is when the sun will go all the way down. I think summer's gonna be a good time for us. I agree. Anything that's when Connor's gonna propose to me. Just kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. I don't know how I'm gonna propose to her. You're supposed to give me a ring. 
You're supposed to give me your ring. Oh yeah. Cause I bought her. Connor and I agree that we're just gonna have him propose to me with this bougie ring. I told her me. to give me it back. <sighs> so I was gonna take the promise ring back. It wasn't even like a super promise ring. I just gave it to her as like a ring for her to wear on her ring finger. So it's basically, it's basically like we're engaged. I don't have mine on because I showered and forgot to put it back on. But it's basically like we're engaged, but we're not. Because we don't call them promise rings. We don't call them engagement rings, but we're basically engaged. We have a house, like, I just have to formally ask now. So I'm like, give me your ring back. And in the span of whenever I want to ask, I'm going to use that ring and propose with it. I did it take was it expensive. off. It was really expensive. I took it off for like a day. And then I was like, then I need my ring. Then she put it back ring. on. Okay, I always need my rings on though. Oh, my messy hands. You already have one, two, three, four. You have five. Six. Can you count? <laughs> I'm not counting that one. I'm oh. If you took it off, you'd have five. It just doesn't feel the same without this one on. Obviously, because you wore it I'll for take the it last off again. almost a year and a half. I know. I think that's why I wanted to put it back on. But then is it even exciting when you get proposed to? You're like, oh, I've seen this ring before. It's not the ring that matters. I it's think the it me. Is. I don't. Because you're shocked by the ring, you're like, oh my gosh. No, it's like the fact that you're about to marry someone that you truly love. Really? They would yeah. I'm not, I feel like it's like when you like see the ring, you're like, oh my gosh, I love it. Obviously, like a girl like is impressed with the ring, don't get me wrong. But I think they're like shocked from like, oh my gosh, this guy is asking to like spend the rest of his life with me. It's like that's what shocks Yeah, I on. agree. Yeah, so I don't think the ring matters. Like, I'm not but gonna be like, oh my gosh, it's not even ring. a surprise. Like, you don't even. Usually, it's a surprise what ring he got you. Maybe I should just We're make more money. We're different. I should just buy. But we don't need a. Did we like... figure out when you proposed, you use the ring? Oh yeah. Is that your ring at your wedding, or no? Do you have to buy? We were just talking about this with your mom. Are you supposed to propose with the wedding ring? I and then just give the wedding band. I don't know. What are these? I'm like, why would you get this a This is one band? of the reasons why I haven't proposed. It's just too much rules. Like, what? <laughs> that doesn't matter. I don't even know. Because the girl's always supposed to have a wedding band. But Maybe I feel they like just I never take it before one. the wedding and use it as a present presentation. I feel like I feel like the wedding band is like so outdated though. Like, I don't see girls wearing wedding bands anymore with their yeah. Wedding they're ring. wearing an engagement ring that's fat as hell. I think. I don't know. I'll just. Google it. <laughs> do you have like ideas of how you want to? Uh -huh. Not, don't speak about it, but like, do you have ideas? I have no clue, because girls are so difficult. Rude. You, it ha it's like, you have to make it perfect. Nothing can go wrong. It has You have to go above and beyond to make sure it's mm -hmm. not too less. I don't think, I used to want you to go be a, above and beyond, but honestly, so I if we went anymore. to the California beach and I proposed, you'd be happy? Mm-hmm. I don't know, dude. Everybody's like, I want it on camera. Well, I honestly would want it on, on camera. Roses. So look I back want, at it. <laughs> I want it all videoed professionally and I want pictures. So that's just like a lot to get set no, up. No, I don't want to do photographer there. I want to do like afterwards, like the whole engagement photos. So you want a professional there after to take pictures? Not there after, I mean like a different day we oh. do our engagement photos. You know, have Why not like somebody like in the parking lot after and then like, okay, let's take pictures. I don't know. Oh, because you might not be like. I'm going to be crying my makeup off. You think I want to take photos of me like, oh. Sure. Our animals are outside running in our dirt backyard. We can't have them in here because their cages are right there and they make a lot of noise in there. They'll cry and one out. So we just thought them outside. Cause we just got home from shopping. We got, what do we get? Um, speakers and a few things from yeah, some Target <laughs> stuff, and then I got some speakers for my PC. But Brittany got her new laptop that she'll be editing this on, hopefully. Computer. You could you could plug it in right here and just set it right here for now. Mm, I don't trust the pets. No, that's why. You I think Rose is gonna knock over a thirty-pound computer? A cord? A cord? Yes. Not. Them, Kobe or Milo though. I'm good. I'm not risking that brand new computer I just bought. He just, didn't even like he still has so much food. I, I'm very picky with fries, so I didn't eat all my fries. This lighting's very bright. I don't even know if you guys saw any of this. You definitely can see some of it, but I ate most of the burger. Fries are iffy. The more I, I eat In and Out, the more I think it's kinda mid, no cap. I've had In N Out in probably like a month or two and this wasn't that good? It makes more sense why it's so cheap. Oh. 
It's definitely better than like McDonald's or Burger King, but I don't know. It's okay, like, it's okay. I just want to talk about Whataburger. I don't like it. You never had it. I forgot. Never mind. We can't talk about it. I have had it, but I think I had breakfast when I was there. Mm. It was, the breakfast was pretty good. Can we order it. At Madeline Stevens? Yeah. But it was breakfast still, I think. We did. I yeah. didn't realize it was breakfast. I've only had breakfast. I had it once in Texas when I was on a tour. We had like pancakes and then we just had it in Texas. We definitely want to see our friends too. We haven't seen any friends in like five months. My birthday's low key coming up. March, April, May, June. I mean, kind of. February, March, we April, May. Some, give me months. some time. Give me some Less time. Less than half a year. He's not letting me have some time to think about what I gotta do. Honestly, all I want, we'll probably already have that flat screen for upstairs, but I just want a TV. What do I want? I don't even know. Oh, look rich. Just kidding. <laughs> we need a TV upstairs. This thing where I like bite my freaking lip, guys. I think you grind your teeth at night. I know I do. It's like right when you fall asleep, I hear it right away when you're oh, laying on that's me. Oh, so bad. And that's so bad for your teeth. I know. I it, need to get a night guard. You heard it? Yeah, like right when you fall asleep. And then... Cause you sleep on me for like 10 minutes and I push you to your side. <laughs> but I hear you. Rude. <laughs> you like, you just bite down. You're like, it's oh not like maybe grinding, God. but you're definitely like biting down like with pressure for some reason. I know, and I know I do that because I wake, up headaches. I wake up and I'm like, your jaw my sore? teeth hurt. Oh. Not my teeth hurt, but like my just mouth feels weird. So like I question myself, I'm like, do I, I think you do this that night? Like you bite them. So bad. And that wears out your teeth really bad. I know, that's terrible. I need to get a night guard. I'm gonna go hit up my old doctor. Or even like retainers help. Mm -hmm. I don't like night guards because they're big. Like I'd rather just wear a retainer. True. Gosh, I wanna fix my bottom tooth and wear a retainer. But my but retainers I, I always throw out. Cause I think I'm choking on them. I don't know if anybody is related to that. My aunt does. My aunt does the Wait, same thing like, as me. Wait, you think you're choking on it while you're Last choking? night I thought I was choking on something. I woke up and I didn't swallow. I went to the sink and spit in it and then I swallowed and I'm like, okay, I was tripping. I think like there's something in my throat. Like I- This guy, to find tweaker in the middle of the night when he sleeps. Like when he's sleepwalking, not walking by. I don't sleep talk anymore really. You were last night, you make weird noises like, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Yeah, I wait for you to say something, you never say anything. You just like, <laughs> you just mumble, like, you just I'm make dreaming. sounds. I just be having some, like I literally, I'm not kidding you, I think I was arguing with you about the whole club situation in my dream last night. Uh, 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 I was like trying to argue with you. I need to get cameras so we can watch our, cause I wanna see what I look like in the middle of the night getting up and tweaking. Oh my gosh, Connor is something else. Like I don't even know how to explain it to you. I just would get up for like 20 or 30 seconds and I snap out of it and I like, We'll go to the bathroom. I don't know. I just get up and start like making noises or talking. Yeah, like there was one time where he woke up in the middle of the night and then he was like pulling up the blankets and he didn't really know and he was like looking oh, for I something. Oh, I did that last night. And then what were you saying? Like, is there a spider or like, is there a snake? I did that last night. I thought there was a spider and I threw the covers. And I didn't wake up. No, you were gone already. It was like, oh. I remember that. I literally. I need to get that. a camera for indoors. I think it'd be so funny rewatching that. Yeah, or I just like. like and he'll just like wake up and like look at me and try to ask me a question. I'm like, just what are you asking? And I like literally like, what? And then he'll be like repeating himself. I'm like, what? It doesn't make any sense. And I'm then, like, are you okay? Yeah. And are you okay? Like, I'm like, yeah, I'm okay. <laughs> and then he'll like, he'll literally keep asking. And then he like wakes up out of nowhere. Yeah, and he's like, I'm just snapping out of it. And he literally says, never mind, just go to sleep. And I'm like, okay. I have night sweats too, bro. I'm something else, man. My dad and has it, night tears, like he screams. That's what I'm saying. I'm a freak out, cause just seeing Connor do I all this. I don't scream. Okay, I know, but like, I can only just imagine like our kids gonna have night tears. And that freaks me out. I like, could. I'm gonna punch it my kids in the, in the face. Like, <laughs> my dad, my dad in Florida when I was just there, woke up like three nights screaming. Like, screams bloody Recently? murder. When we were in Florida, yeah, he still does it. What? That's scary, dude. He, he wakes up, he goes, <laughs> <laughs> really? That, that That's loud. so sad. Like, does he wake up after doing that or no? <laughs> it's so mean, but my grandpa, he's like, you wouldn't stop. <laughs> my grandpa's like, you wouldn't shut up. So what did he do? My grandpa went out there and like made sure he was okay, but he like, <laughs> 
Like super loud, like louder than that. Like screams, like ah! Dang. No, night Maybe terrors freak here. me out. It's I, definitely scary, I feel bad. No, I, and like it's just crazy cause like, they look like they're awake. Like people who have night terrors. Like I used to babysit this girl and she had night terrors. Her ass was sleeping. And literally she would like, start crying and going around the house just like walking and running look say like saying where's my mom where's that's my mom? creepy and i'm just like what does she mean where is her mom like i'm over here freaking out and then she comes to like my door and would open it because i used to never lock it because i was a nanny and she would be like i can't find britney i can't find britney like just staring at me and saying it to me and i'm like and then when she wakes up yeah, and like, no, she wouldn't wake up. That's the crazy part. Like, you would have to kind of like force her to go to bed. Like, I would have to grab her and like make her lay down with That's me. That's creepy. And like, eventually she would just like fall asleep. That's creepy. Like, they never wake up. It's so scary. Or there'd be a time where she would just like bang on my door. Oh, hell no. <laughs> and I would cry. Or there would also be other times where I'm like sleeping and I just, you know how like when you're sleeping, you feel someone's watching you and you like wake up and check? I felt that and I woke up, she was just staring at me like, I'm not even kidding you, just like full on standing like. Oh hell no, <laughs> I, I would've about, quit, right? I was about to scream. Nah, I would've quit. <laughs> that was so scary, dude. If it's your kid, cool, but nah. And I would punch my kid. I was like some kid just stare at me. Oh, heck no. <laughs> I was scared. I would've quit. And I didn't, like I never knew what night terrors were. Like I've never heard of it. My brothers never did it when I was growing up. I've never had that problem. I'm gonna Google it. Like how rare are they? I, I mean, people like have nightmares, common. but night terrors are I like often. Like as I'm getting older, I feel like it's so common. I always hear people saying, "I have night terrors." I'm like, "What?" I think I have some set form of it. I don't like scream. I just like dream a lot or talk about it in my sleep. I'm gonna cry for kids. After. Like I'm just literally thinking about that. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna be like, "Let me lock nah. you in your room." I'm just kidding. I don't know. We'll look it up if it's genetics. I hope not. Guys, that's it. Oh, that's it. Because I finished my food. I'm full. And I love food. It's a good meal. Mid, mid to good meal. Guys, it kind of hit the spot, but... I think I just hit my spot because I was starving. I you barely ate today. I know. That's why I feel like it was just like, I just wanted to eat. Let us know if you enjoyed the mukbang and if you want us to do more of these. Um, we do like eating, so... We could even do like a cooking video where Brittany shows what she cooks and then we eat. <laughs> but yeah, we could do that. Let us know down below if you're interested in that. Um, comment other video ideas and hopefully we'll start posting more. Just waiting for the summer to be here in the nice weather. It's just like depressing. We're always inside, not doing much. Yeah. We'll awesome. try and get back on YouTube as much as we can. We would, we're doing good. We just had, I had a lot going on with my work life and me having to work overtime. We're still having a lot going on. Move in. Yeah. We're still not even close to being done with this house. I'm still waiting on my freaking kitchen table. That's a whole nother story, but. Yeah, it's been a lot. Yeah, I've just got a lot going on and we appreciate you guys for sticking around, the ones I have, and that keep watching us and supporting us. You are the best. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new to our channel and we will see you guys on our next video. Bye.